Hi, I'm Mike Hughes, and welcome back to Your Hands on the Reins. This is going to be part two of solving barn sour behavior and bulking. Bulking meaning your horse refuses to go forward and they start backing up. So we're going to cover those two issues today. This is Sid. This is our second time on him in three days, and let's see how he does here today. And the key to our behavior is one, it's going to take us twice as long to get home, and two, is patience coming home. At the end of part one the other day with Sid, he got a lot better coming back. He'd at least stand still. Um, not in, at the end, he wasn't trying to charge through the bit anymore. So we're going to go ahead and take him out now, and we're going to go up. Uh, see, there, there he's bulking, so this is a good uh, sign of bulking. So I'm just going to keep bumping him forward. So that is a... So that was a classic sign of bulking. Um, that is barn sour. He wanted to start backing up as I was bumping him forward. So now we got that to work with. So now he's going forward pretty nicely. So uh, that was a really good sign of, so the bulking was a barn sour behavior where he wanted to back up and I had to bump him forward. He wanted to back up so he could go home. Um, so we got, we got a lot of work still to do with him. I did work them two days ago in part one. I didn't work them yesterday because it was raining so hard and so windy out. Just kind of stayed home all day. And uh, so this is, uh, this will be a second lesson in three days and we'll see what he uh, retains uh, from coming back. Uh, last time we were coming back, he got a little prancy in the beginning. Um, he didn't want to do the speed control. He tried charging through the bit. He was pawing the ground when we did come to a stop. So we're just going to get him up here and see what he retained. There he wants to bulk again. So I'm going to keep his nose in the direction I want him to go in. I'm going to keep bumping him. Keep bumping him. And there he went forward. So now he's going to be on loose rein, 15 to 20 seconds. And then we'll go back forward again. And he's just looking around, which is fine. So there's my 15 to 20 seconds. He knows he's facing towards home now and he's doing a really good job. So we'll go back forward again. He is walking slower out here today. A lot slower going home. This is really nice. Good, I'm gonna go ahead and slow him down. Good, that was a little bit better of a stop. Um, again, he wasn't trying to charge through the bit or push through the bit. He's just a little bit heavy coming to the stop. And yes, there's a huge difference in him, you know, really pulling on that bit and stiffening up that neck than just being a little heavy in the stop. So um, I do know I need to work with him on the stops and his backs. Um, but right now we're going to work on uh, barn sour behavior. So there we have loose rein on him. He's looking and chewing a little bit. He looks really good. Good. And let's go forward again. So this is a preview to part two on solving barn sour behavior and bulking out on the trails. To see this video in full, join my membership site. Just go to Google, type in Mike Hughes Horsemanship Members page, click on the link and subscribe. When you do subscribe, join my group page on Facebook where you can post your videos of you working with your horse, pictures and ask questions so I can help you and your horse more. I have over 280 videos on my membership page with step-by-step -step, easy to follow methods that you can go by and that your horse can go by and learn in a calm relaxed manner like all horses should so we hope you're enjoying these previews and be sure to join my membership page thank you